Following the Swapo Party's Central Committee meeting held at the weekend, the party's candidates contesting for Vice Presidency, Secretary General, and Deputy Secretary General were introduced. President Genkop reminded the candidates that in the Swapo Party, the culture has always been to play the ball and not the person or competitors as they sell themselves to the Congress delegates why they are the right candidates. You are campaigning to articulate to the masses why you are the most suitable candidate to lead Swapo Party. It should be that simple. Not to bad mouth the others, not to say I'm the better one tribally or so on. No. We are simply saying I will be the one to take over to lead Swapo to prosperity. Dr. Genkop also reminded party members that there will be no individual victory at the end of the race, but it is the party that will emerge victorious with its outstanding democratic process. When that game is over, then you can hug, like we do in soccer, in boxing. And to mean to congratulate the winner, a swap winner. So we are therefore starting to march on to defy these negative comments made about Swapo is finished. That's your wishful thinking. But you will not frighten them. You should play the game in a secret way. To let them believe that you are finished. But now you already came out to destroy them. The president, who was endorsed and opposed as sole candidate, also announced his intention to step down before the 2024 elections. So we are going to do it in such a way, only with Hagia, of course, that he, this guy, will resign at appropriate time. So that there will be whatever arrangements that persons who are going to emerge will take over. So that that day... <laughs> That way, the person who is going to stand for 2024 elections will not be this guy, as you know. So the person who is going to stand must be a swap of president, new one. That's what we are trying to do. We are too clever. They were wondering why is he coming unopposed? Huh? We do our things that way. That is the reason. Now you know. Any form of decampaigning their competitors by directly or indirectly defaming them via social media, interviews, and other forms of communication are prohibited. The candidates are also not allowed to criticize the policies of the Swapo Party during their campaign. Promising offers, rewards, or dishing out payments to delegates or giving them gifts is also a serious violation of the campaign rules. The rules are a supplement of the already existing code of conduct and party constitution and candidates found in violation will be disqualified from contesting. The three vice presidential hopefuls are Saraku Wongelwa Amadira, incumbent vice president Netumbo Nandindaitwa and Pohamba Shifeta. For the position of the secretary general, the incumbent Sophia Shaningwa will square off against Oshikoto Regional Swapo Coordinator Almas Ampuyu, while Evelyn Navases Tayele, Lucia Vetboy, Wahekwa Herunga, and David Hamtenya are eyeing the Deputy Secretary General's office. Timo Andreas, NBC News, Ventuk.